Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Happy Monday. I received an epic package from none other than Mr. Crafty Hoplock. And I've been anticipating this package for a few days now. So I'm super excited to open it. I did go ahead and untape the box because if you have ever gotten anything from Alicia, you know it is it's taped to high heaven. So I did unpack everything and um, so I have some scissors ready because these packages have tape on them as well. And um, so this is a very much appreciated birthday gift. However, it was not necessary. Um, I sent uh, Mr. Hoplop a very sexy shoe that he needed in order not to re-injure or further injure himself while he was trying to ambulate. And you can never say that I don't send practical gifts sometimes. It may have not been the cutest, the most stylish, or fashion forward, but um, I am hopefully saving him from not injuring his hip or knee on the other side. So, um, And I wanted to do that because they do so much for the community, both Alicia and Mr. Hoplop. You know, he doesn't always get the recognition recognition that he also deserves, but he is a very integral part in um, the crafty community's COVID relief efforts over the past year, so I don't want him to go unnoticed in that. Also, if you see in the background a new addition to the craft room. This is my husband's custom iris container storage. It is eight foot tall, yes. Yes, I know, I will have to have a step stool. The top of it is not um, full. Um, so I started at the bottom and just worked my way up. Um, it is not mounted to the wall yet. It is also not painted yet because we know that this isn't our forever home. So um, this will have to be dismantled when we moved and he may modify it a little bit so um, he didn't want to make anything too permanent but um, he pays attention you guys because he sees the struggle in here sometimes and uh, when he did this he was like you know you're gonna have a really cool craft room when we get our own place when we get our forever own place and uh, I'm able to really put my vision in into reality and he explained what he had in his mind, so I'm super excited. Um, we plan on being here probably another year or so just to get our um, credit back in order and then we can purchase a new um, place. So with that said and without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this package. It was in a very large box and it was stuffed to the gills. Um, so. This must be the tablecloth that Alicia was talking about that she wraps with, which that is super cool, really fun idea, yay, I love this, thank you so much, I, I've never seen this at our Dollar Trees, um, and I did want this very, very badly. So I appreciate that. Thank you so much. Um, this one I may keep inside because I decorate our Christmas tree in gnomes and vintage campers. But this one that Alicia actually thought I would not care for, I love this. And this is going on the outside. Um, it's just kitschy, you know, it's just kitschy to me, and I think it's super cute, and it, it matches, of course, these are the colors I do, the red, the traditional bright red, bright green, and white, and my Christmas tree is black, but you can't tell that my Christmas tree is black, because I usually use it for Halloween also, but we didn't do that this year, 
So once I have all of this stuff up, you can't really tell that I have a black tree. So I actually really, really love my tinsel um, camper as well. Awesome. Okay, and then this one, I want to keep that. So I'm going to throw it over there. This one is the um, sign that I had asked Alicia. Sorry for the crinkle. I'd ask Alicia to grab this if she could find it. This is really heavy too. This is a nice sign. Um, but I couldn't find this at any of the Dollar Trees. Any of the four I went to. Could not find this. Awesome, awesome. Was it missing something? Something may have been, it looks like something may have been stuck there, or I could be wrong because the O is missing. So I'm not sure, but we'll figure it out. Love this, and it will go in the um, Halloween decorations. So the stuff that is not wrapped is this cute little tumbler. Um, I use these from Dollar Tree, you guys. In fact, there's like three of them in my floorboard of my car because I never get them out. And it has these hot chocolate melt away Santas, and I have never, I've never had these before. So you add it to hot milk, and it makes cocoa. That's cool. I'll have to try that in this mug. Thank you, thank you. And then he gets. You, you didn't even have to send anything else in this package. This, this is amazing. Even my husband did not know what my favorite, favorite chocolate was. And it's Godiva truffles. And um, in my previous life, I did visit the Godiva store and I would splurge and get um, truffles and chocolate, tr chocolate covered strawberries. Um, yeah, but I haven't had these in years, so thank you, thank you, thank you. Alright, so I hope these weren't meant to go in any sort of order. We do have, because no package would be complete without a COVID supply. We have some wet wipes. And I was supposed to go to my office today. But I just couldn't get my life together on a Monday to go in there after being off all last week. Um, I guess I was hungover from being on vacation, being vacation drunk. Even though I didn't do anything, I just, I, I couldn't get it together this morning. And you know, when you clock in and it's like, oh my god, why did I even take a vacation? Because your work is triple what it was when you left. But yeah. There was no way I was going into the office, so these will go in my purse so that when I do make it in there tomorrow, I have them and I can wipe down the desk that I sit at. Because you never know who's been there, sitting there, in the interim of you having been there. I don't know if he took all of this. But I know that Alicia is a, is a tape fanatic. And they don't use cheap tape, no, let me tell you. It's, it's hardcore tape. And this pretty paper, thick paper. That's 
amazing because I'm using up my E6000 right now as we speak. Fabulous. Okay. Let's start with this little one. It is cupcake liners. Thank you. Now you are going to force me to make cupcake liner rosettes. I have not mastered these yet. Susan did a pretty good tutorial after I asked because I just can't get the hang of them. So um, I actually don't have any because I got mad and I threw them all away. So now I'm going to try it again, I promise. That is funny. <laughs> ah, you're going to make me revisit stuff I had given up on. I don't get those or crepe paper rosettes. I just, I can't do them. Oh, that's so funny. And we have Baker's Flying. Ooh, pretty Christmas colors. I don't have um, any of those, the multi ones. Wow, this comes at a perfect time. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So I'm working on one uh, fall swap and then I get to start on my Christmas stuff. So that's gonna stay right here on the desk. Oh, Mr. Hoplop, you're doing so good. There's no saving paper when it comes from the Wagman abode. These? Ooh, they're clear in different sizes and in their own container. That is super helpful. Thank you. Wow, that'll go just right in my little drawer right here, and I won't even have to re you know, separate them into another container. All right, let's do this one. I think this is so fun and fantastic because my husband would absolutely die if he had to do any of this. Oh, what is this? so cute oh wait oh my gosh it's a cow and a pig there's one of or yeah no there's two of each oh my gosh you guys look I love her oh, these are so cute oh I might have to do a tree now for the might have to do a tree for the crafter. Love those. Thank you. My dog is barking outside. these and he got me some oh these are so cute I haven't even been inside Walmart in a very very long time um, I'll order groceries and pick them up but I have just chosen not to visit Walmart and I had bad FOMO when Alicia shared her haul of all the cute Christmas ornaments these are super adorable. 
So yes, I'm gonna have to get a small tree for the craft room. And I have space for it too. All right. I'm so happy. He did so good. No way. said serious FOMO I, I'm not joking and this was the other one that I oh my god it's a birthday Christmas camper oh I love this you guys this is epic this is like a camper mail I love it Alright, just grabbing what's in front of me, y'all. No way. Dollar Tree? No way. You found Nomi towels at the Dollar Tree? Oh, I love these. I haven't seen these. Wow, I am. And I love these kind of towels. Uh, it's kind of microfiber, but not, not the normal one that sticks to you. This one is so cute. These won't be used, of course. They'll just go on the stove for decoration. But I love those so, so much. Okay, this one has a lot of tape. Feels like a ribbon spool. And it's buffalo. Buffalo platter. Buffalo check. I love it. Thank you. I didn't have this. I did not have that. So fabulous. And even though this is the fall stuff from Dollar Tree, excuse me, um, this is perfect farmhouse all year round. All right. so cute in person oh my gosh so this is the little pink set this is the craft room tree all I literally have to do for the craft room tree is buy a tree that's epic and then these are the traditional ones so these will go in the living room on that tree I love these I love these so much all of them Wow, these are really, really cute. He should be so proud of himself. Oh, so fun. campers and bears and trees oh my oh you guys I love socks I love fun socks these are so cute I don't have this camper pair thank you y'all know I stay cold and I love to wear fun socks 
All right, let's see. I'm trying to look for an opening. These are the gold, the silver, and the diamond. I um, am almost out of my diamond. So this comes at a perfect time again for Christmas. Mr. Hoplop, you did so good. So good. This one's a double decker, so we're gonna cut this top one off. And if I had to guess, this is a flower or a pick of some sort. There we go. Too hard because I don't know if it's attached. Oh, this is cool. This is going to be amazing to cut some of the, you know, cut these sprigs and use on pocket letters because it's like they have, um, well, they look like seed beads, but I don't think they are. It's like little diamonds. So cool on a Christmas pocket letter. Yep. Ideas are a spinning. It lost some of its little crystals though. That is okay. That gives all kinds of ideas. You could buy the plain ones and just diamond dust them. I'm sure people do that. I'm sure that's not me. <laughs> but it's not something I've done. Tool in the Aw, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. How epic. Must have tool for intricate dyes. And yes, dyes like that. This will come in super handy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. This is like the perfect blend of crafty and fun. I mean, crafty is fun, but there's good variety here. What is this? beans.
that's the uh, the Dollar Tree gnome, y'all. I knew, I just knew. I've been looking for it, and I just had conceded that I would never find one or get one because I can't find them. And he sent him. I love him. Yay. Mm. That driver's seat smells good, too. I love him. And he was almost a sack of beans. Wow, I cannot believe this is at the Dollar Tree. He matches my um, towels with his little Nordic hat. And he will join my little collection on the mantle. Oh, I love him. Thank you. Love. Okay. We're down to the last two. And here's the one lonely bag topper that Alicia. Ooh, we're at 26 minutes. Love, love, love these. I have one pack that I was hoarding. Now I can use it because I have another one. I was so afraid to use that one. Oh, I love those. Thank you. All right. I'm looking at the time now. My phone will actually cut off. Yeah. This is, um, it matches some of the things I have been buying for the kitchen. So this is actually going to go on top of my pie safe and it matches perfectly. Thank you. Right now it's, I have a crochet table runner up there, but this one will come out for Christmas. Wow. This is epic. This, this was truly epic. This was a blessing. Um, so many cute things. You did so good, Mr. Hop Hop. <laughs> Don't let Alicia knock you. You can do this. I have faith in you. You picked the perfect things. Like, it all makes sense. I know where your head was, and I appreciate you. You hit every one of my most favorite things on the, on the nose. Wow. Thank you, thank you, thank you for just being you. I mean, this this was totally, like I said, you did not have to do this, but I appreciate you and everything that you do and for sharing so much of your wife with me and the rest of the crafty community. She's one of my truly, truly um, closest friends and I just appreciate you both so much. You, you'll never know because I know we're all non-huggers, but uh, virtual hugs, you guys. Uh, love you both, and I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. It was so much fun, and I'm just so appreciative. It, it This was epic. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Mr. Hoplop. You truly made my birthday super special, and I appreciate you for that. All right, you guys, I will see y'all in the next video. Much love.